Hello everyone and welcome back to a new speed build video. Today we are doing a makeover of the uh, apartment where my not so very sims are living. Which is due to events that happened in the latest episode. Um, yeah, so if you haven't watched that, go and watch that and then this video will make more sense or not. You do you. It doesn't really matter uh, that much. Um, but since they tie together, let's give some backstory to why this happened. <laughs> so, uh, I was playing my sim, uh, my main sim, Noah's family, like his parents and his siblings, when I get a notification that says that he and the uh, girl he's been sort of dating uh, suddenly moved in together. So, what happens when you move in to, with someone? You have a lot of stuff you bring with you, and you need to combine your two households. So, this is what I'm doing in today's video. Uh, Noah also had a roommate from before. Uh, so, uh, I had to switch some rooms around. And uh, this room that I'm currently working on is the roommate's room, which is the random NPC sim that you can't really play with. That's just not a part of your household. So, yeah, that's the room. Um, whoa, what happened there? Um, so now I'm uh, moving on to the room that's... Uh, Noah and Morgans, uh, because the girl he moved in with is from the Get Together Pack, the um, Morgan Fires girl. Uh, so uh, Noah has the uh, right, yes, right side of the bed with the mint alarm clock because Gen One is mint. And Morgan's side is the uh, left one, with the round table. Uh, so yeah, I've decided to move the, one of the floor. I, I utilized most uh, of the stuff from that Noah had before, and then I moved in, changed some things around. I bought them a new bed, because Morgan, in my head, didn't really like the old one that Noah had. So they bought a new one together. Um, his desk is still the same as it was before. Uh, I just um, changed things around and added some clutter and uh, also, yeah, gave the apartment a general touch up to indicate that someone else is currently also living there. Uh, this, uh, so one of Morgan's likes in this save is that she likes the color pink, so I tried to um, put some pink accent color and some touches of pink in some places that the uh, date bucket reward I decided to just keep in the inventory in the inventory for now. I uh, also decided to get rid of some posters and put in some more real art. Some uh, some uh, blankets and cushions there for the couch. Pink, which is the color that Morgan liked. Uh, to you know, give a nod to the fact that she does like pink in this in this universe. I added a rug in the uh, living room, 
and uh, since Noah didn't have a coffee table before, I decided to give them give them coffee tables, and I used these two from uh, the uh, Oasis kit, uh, whatever it's called, the Oasis, uh, not the Oasis Springs kit, but that kit that's like Moroccan inspired, and I put a little candle on it because I like them because they kind of look like those uh, tray tables that were really trendy uh, around like 2014. They also put up some curtains in, um, or I imagine Morgan did put up some curtains in the, uh, well in the living room area. I went with neutral ones. Uh, or, yeah, because I didn't really, I mean, she just likes pink, she's not like, oh, I'm so into pink, you know? I cleaned up the trash at the balcony and added in some plant pots. Uh, so, yeah, because I imagined that Morgan was also really, really, really high wellness scale. So I imagined her to like... Um, uh, you, I, in the end, I do add in uh, like a yoga mat for her um, as well. But I also like s since she's really into wellness, I imagine her to like want to, you know, grow her own herbs and stuff, like actual herbs, basil and sage and maybe strawberries and stuff. We are coming into. I just realized. I was gonna say we are coming into summer, but I just realized in the game, strawberries bloom in the spring, right? So that's not gonna work, but maybe we can find something else for her to, to grow out there in the balcony in the summer. And in the kitchen, I added in some... Uh, it just made it a little bit more, you know, lived in... Uh, with some knives from the Home Chef Hustle stuff pack. Yes, it's a stuff pack, not a kit. Um, and put in some water bottles. Uh, added a little book on the table, some jewelry in the bedroom. And bathroom, I also just put in. And some clutter, of course. Made it look a little more like she lives here too now. And uh, I gave Noah some headphones for his, uh, uh, so that he can, you know, work on his stuff on the computer without disturbing everyone else. And uh, now I'm giving her the yoga mat. Have I done... Now, now I am doing the, uh, the bathrooms. I'm just... Realized I somehow, somewhere, turned off move objects. So, but I added in that light switch and a towel. Some... Um, I don't know if that's, like... I want to say, like, face cream and and stuff like that in those uh, bottles, a uh, pink robe, which is Morgan's, because remember, she likes pink. Uh, yeah, here I wanted those tubes or bottles to be uh, on the shelf, so I used the uh, little Dream Home decorator cube to slide them into place, which works great. I also tried to fit these uh, uh, jars in, but I couldn't really get them to fit in, so I have to get rid of them, unfortunately. And then uh, put some bath salts and bottles and at the top, and this little, you know, shower. Uh,
thing. <laughs> and now I'm doing a, uh, well, I wanted to make a shower curtain, but then I realized, yeah, right, it can't be on that side because that's where they actually get into the top. So I had to move it to the other side. I used the Desert Lux curtains for the shower curtain. Uh, made it green because it is the not so very mint generation. So, and a little bath mat. And then I decided to, yeah, well, can't be like a perfect bathroom. Then I put in a little water stain behind the uh, the um, waste uh, basket there. It, speaking of that, it's so weird to not have to have bathrooms without waste baskets, right? I always have one in all the bathrooms I've ever had. Uh, back to the build, we are now doing some uh, Cloth hooks in the um, hallway and some shoes. Um, adding in a rug in the hallway. And a mirror over the uh, dining table to make the room feel a little larger. I tried a few different ones but ended up going with the one I usually use for this, which is the Seasons one. And I also added in a better, or another kind of, another light. This uh, one from, it's, a, it's from Fitness Stuff, right? I think so. I like to use that one as a dining room light. And some uh, salt and pepper shakers. And in the kitchen I also added a cutting board. And some decor in the hallway. Changed out a light again, and you know, just making it feel a little more like two people decided to uh, combine their stuff. And yeah, now I didn't doesn't really care about decorating that much, so I didn't have a lot of stuff before. So yeah. In the uh, living room, though, they put these shelves up. Perfect for, like, plant decorations. And they also plan on putting some pictures and stuff up here, maybe, as we continue playing. We are now moving uh, shortly into screenshots. So I'm going to say bye for now and hope to see you in another video, perhaps. So have a great day and uh, I'll see you soon. Bye.